Hello everyone, my name is Harshada and welcome to my channel Loft Academia. Today we will be discussing IEO International English Olympiad Class 2. Chapter 5 Pronouns So pronoun is a word which is used in place of a noun or a phrase which contains nouns. Okay, so for example, um, Harshada is teaching you Olympiad videos. She uploads videos every week. So the second sentence, instead of repeating Harshada, I am saying she, S-H-E, she, which is a pronoun. So likewise, you will have um, many pronouns which you can use, such as he, she, us, you, we, they, these, etc. So we will see all these in the chapter. Section A. Choose the appropriate personal pronouns for the underlined words. Okay, so question number one. Rishi is making too much noise. So Rishi is a boy. So the pronoun which will be used for him is he. He is making too much noise. Okay. Question number two. The desert was hot and dry. Okay. So, because we are talking about a place, we cannot use he, she or we. We will use it was hot and dry. So, please tick option B. Meena bought a black and white cat. Meena is a girl. We will use she. She bought a black and white cat. Question number 4. Seema and Dev are watching a movie. We are talking about two people here. That's why you would use they are watching a movie, which is option A. Question number five. My uncle brought a book for my sister and me. So we are talking about two, two people over here. And that is why you will use us. My uncle brought a book for us. So which is option A. Section B. Fill in the blanks with suitable pronouns. My trousers are old. I have worn dash for a long time. We are talking about trousers, which is plural, not singular. My trousers are old. I have worn them for a long time. That is why you will use them because it is plural. Owls are the birds with big eyes. You can see, again we are talking about more than one owl, owls. So you can see them at night. Okay, so which is option B. Question number 8. This is my favorite chair. Dash is made of wood. So we are talking cha about chair which is a non-living thing. Okay, so that's why we will not use he or anything else. This is my chair. So we are talking about one chair. That is why you will use it is made of wood, which is option C. Question number nine. May Dash have some lunch? May I have some lunch? Ask Harry. Of course, replies his mother. So, you are talking about one person who is asking his mom. So, that is why the pronoun which will be used is I. May I have some lunch? So, which is option A. Question number 10. Dash must do your homework on time. You must do your homework. Okay. We are talking to one person, right? Generally, um... This is a sentence which parents say to their children. You must do your homework on time. That is why option T is the answer. Question number 11. Rick is very naughty. Dash is drawing on the wall. So we are talking about Rick. Okay, who is a boy. And that is why you will use he. He is drawing on the wall. Question number 12. Every muscle in your body helps dash to move. In your body, right? Every muscle in your body will help who? Of course, you, right? So, every muscle in your body helps you to move. 
which is option C. Question number 13. Your neck joins your head to dash body. Okay. So your neck will join your head to whose body? Somebody else's body? No. To your body. That is why B is the answer. Question number 14. I love my father and mother very much. Dash love me too. We are talking about two people. Right? Which is plural. That is why you will use they. I love my father and mother very much. They love me too. So which is option C. Question number 15. Dash are my pencils. Those are yours. Okay. So since we are talking about pencils which is plural. Right. So you will use either these or those. Right. But since you are talking about pencils which are near to you because where you are standing the other sentence you are saying is those are yours. So which means these pencils are near to you and those pencils are far from you. And that is why you will say these are my pencils, those are yours. Agar ye sentence nahi diya hota, to confusion hota ki these use karna hai ki those use karna hai. Because this sentence has been given, it means these are my pencils, yahaan wali rakhi hui pencils meri hai or those are yours, wahaan wali tumhari hai. Right? So that is why option C is the answer. Question number 16. Dash won first prize. Everyone praised Dash. Okay. So, if you try to substitute these answers also, uh, you will see that you are you're getting weird, weird sentences. Okay. So, let us try doing that. My won first prize. Everyone praised me. Everyone praised me is correct. But you cannot use my won prize. Okay. When you are talking about yourself, you have to say I. I won first prize. Everyone praised me. That should be the correct one. Okay. You won first prize. Everyone praised me. If someone has won prize, why would they praise me? Right. So that is also not correct. I won first prize. Everyone praised me. That is correct. And should be the answer. Let us still look at the next one. Me won first prize. Everyone praised I. No. It has to be the other way around. The first time when you are using, it has to be always I. And because you are talking about yourself again, to me use kar sakte. Isme ek aur way hai, um, which you can say if, if this is, because it is I and me, it is for one person. But if it is for plural, we won first prize, everyone praised us. Okay, that should be the second one. Agar wo we or us hota, to that would have been also answer. Okay. Question number 17. Uncle Bob is an officer in the army. Dash tells the soldier what to do. We are talking about Uncle Bob. Okay. So, who is male? So, that is why the pronoun which we will use for him is he. Uncle Bob is an officer in the army. He tells the soldiers what to do. Okay. These are my new toys. I like. But because you are talking about toys, which is plural. Agar ek toy hota, this is my new toy. I like it. But because we are talking about these, which means the plural. These are my new toys, plural. I like them. That is why D is the answer. Question number 19. Dash, I am writing a letter to my grandmother okay so i am writing you're talking about self right so that is why i should be used agar he or she hota to she is writing he is writing hota because it is am so it will be i am writing a letter to my grandmother okay question number 20 the children are hungry children plural one is child, plural is children. The children are hungry. Dash wants something to eat. They, 
because we are talking about many children we can't be using he or she right so that is why they they want something to eat it is plural question number 21 dash family and dash live in mathura is tarah ke question mein try karo by substituting the options you family and your live in mathura nahi ye agar ulta hota your family and you live in mathura to bhi correct hota okay those family and him live in mathura no that is so doesn't sound right na those family and him his family and him bhi theek hota okay my family and i live in mathura yes this is correct you're talking about your own family my family and i live in mathura they family and i no this is also not correct okay that's why option c is correct my uncle gifted me a toy car ek car diya hai uncle ne dash is my favorite toy because you're talking about one toy car you are talking about a singular item right that is why you will use it it is my favorite toy theek hai agar ye cars hota my uncle gifted me toy cars they are my favorite toys aise hota but because you are talking about one toy it is t it is my favorite toy question number 23 sarita fell ill but dash went to the picnic okay sarita fell ill but he went to the picnic nahi kya relation hai sarita hai ladki hai we are talking about her that is why the pronoun to be used should be she sarita fell ill but she went to the picnic which is option b or it to ho nahi sakta non living thing nahi hai na sarita okay or them to plural to hai nahi to we can't use that question number 24 What are dash doing in the class? ये बहुत बार क्वेश्चन पेरेंट्स पूछते हैं किड्स को वॉट आर यू डूइंग इन द क्लास ओके सो दैट इज वाई ऑप्शन ए इज द आंसर क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी फाइव माई नेम इज गीता डैश एम अ गुड गर्ल सो वेन यू आर टॉकिंग अबाउट योर सेल्फ यू विल से माई नेम इज गीता I am a good girl. अपने बारे में बात कर रहे हो ना तो ही शी इट क्यों डालना राइट सो आई एम अ गुड गर्ल दैट इज वाई सी इज द आंसर लेट इज लुक एट द नेक्स्ट सेक्शन अचीवर्स सेक्शन ऑल्सो नोन एज हॉट्स एंड दे कैरी टू मार्क्स ईच इन द क्वेश्चन पेपर चूज द करेक्ट ऑप्शन टू कंप्लीट ईच सेंटेंस क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी सिक्स वी लिव इन इंडिया वी लव डैश कंट्री ओके सो वी लिव इन इंडिया वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट आर सेल्स अपने बारे में बात करें तो हम प्यार करेंगे अपनी कंट्री से राइट दैट इज वाई वी लिव इन इंडिया वी लव योर कंट्री इन करेक्ट है वी लव आवर कंट्री इज करेक्ट राइट यू कैंट यूज आर सॉर इट्स हियर ओके सो वी लव आवर कंट्री इज द करेक्ट आंसर क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी सेवन Meena and Maya are cousins. We are talking about two girls over here. Dash go to school together. They go to school together, right? Meena and Maya, talking about two people, so plural. That is why you will say they go to school together. Question number twenty-eight. My puppy is very cute. Dash has a brown coat. Okay, you are talking about puppy, uh, which is animal. सो एनिमल के लिए रेफर करने के लिए इट यूज करते हैं एंड बिकॉज दिस इज सिंगुलर यू विल यूज इट माई पपी इज वेरी क्यूट इट हैज अ ब्राउन कोट विच इज ऑप्शन डी क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी नाइन अवर नेबर्स हैव कॉन ऑन हॉलीडे नेबर्स प्लूरल डैश कैट इज विथ अस नाउ सो कैट किन किसकी है उनकी है राइट देर कैट दैट इज वाई देर कैट विल बी दी आंसर देर कैट उनकी कैट इज विथ अस नाउ बिकॉज दे हैव गॉन टू दे हैव गॉन फॉर हॉलीडे क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टी 
my brother and grandmother love diwali we are talking about two people dash enjoy this festival a lot plural hai that is why you will use they my brother and grandmother love diwali they enjoy this festival a lot so with this we completed our chapter pronouns so let us move to the table of content and put a tick mark on chapter 5 yes this is done as well thank you so so much for watching this video till this point in time please show your love and support with the subscription to my channel loft academia stay blessed and stay safe bye bye